Hello everyone, welcome back to my YouTube channel and a big warm welcome if you're new here. My name is Dragona and today's video is going to be a really, really exciting one, which I hope you're all going to enjoy. Um, so I'm going to be filming a gift guide for her, which I think is perfect at this time of year with Christmas, New Year, um, you know, just it being gifting season. Um, and I wanted to start off by saying that I'm so, so happy because I am collaborating with my favourite jewellery brand, Ana Luisa. Um, I absolutely love them. I'm wearing one of the pieces now. Um, but the reason that I think they make a perfect, perfect gift, um, not just for this holiday season, but for birthdays, for, for any kind of occasion, if you're looking to treat someone that you love, is because the pieces are so beautiful, so unique, and really, really affordable. Um, I love the fact that they have like a variety of items starting from I think $39 if I'm correct um, but yeah like really really affordable pieces that are just so beautiful that will last and um, you know I, I just find something about gifting jewellery it's sentimental um, it's something that can stay with you throughout your whole life and it's just something really nice and personal. So that's one of the reasons that I love them. Another reason is the fact that they are carbon neutral. So um, this is a lot better for our environment. So if I can support a brand like that, I would always do so. Um, and yeah, the packaging that the items arrive in is just so, so cute. Um, and also I love the fact that they just ship worldwide and their delivery is super speedy. I mean, they have different options, um, but if you, opt for like the fast delivery i think it, the items arrive within like a couple of days which is amazing um but look at this little packaging so i was lucky enough to be able to select three items and the first one i'm actually wearing and it's my favorite i think it's just so beautiful i mean look at the design look at the quality just everything and even like the little um logo of Ana luisa here on the clasp it's just so pretty like this is by far my favorite thing that I own from them. So thank you so much for sending this through. Um, yeah, this is the first item. Then I got another two items, one of which I am planning to gift to my mum. I wanted to actually have her included in this video so that you could see her reaction <laughs> to opening this, but she's on holiday at the moment. So um, once she gets back, I will try to film that as part of another vlog. Um, but yeah, I got two earrings so the first one is one that i selected for my mum and i'm going to show you so she really really likes like either silver or white gold jewelry she's not really into gold jewelry whereas me i'm more into the gold um so yeah i just wanted to show you the ones that i selected for her she doesn't like things that are like too dainty but she doesn't like big earrings so she likes something like quite simple and um i thought these were perfect and she's always losing like she had one pair of earrings, I can't remember from where, which she really liked and she lost them and she's always like, I don't have any earrings and stuff. So I just thought this will be a perfect little gift for her. So I'm just going to show you guys, look how stunning they are. So they're really nice and small, but at the same time, they're not too small and I just think they're going to look so beautiful on her. And um, so, yeah, I think I'm really excited to give these to her. I think she's going to be super happy. Um, and then the other pair of earrings are another pair of silver ones, silver hoops. So I am more into, oh, one second, just had to grab the correct one because that's actually from the ones that I've got on my ears now, which I'm going to talk to you about in a minute. But yeah, um, I'm actually into gold jewellery more, but I do like silver jewellery sometimes as well. And I just thought these hoops were super cute, really, really simple. I absolutely love them. Um, yeah, so I thought I'll have something silver for myself as well. Um, I just think they're going to look beautiful. I haven't got either of the earrings on to show you now because <laughs> I actually have another pair of Ana Luisa earrings that they didn't send to me that I purchased from the website myself because I do actually shop from there. I love their products and um, I wouldn't be recommending them if I didn't. Um, uh, and the earrings that I'm wearing are these tiny little ones here so you can see I've got like all these patches and actually I've got another pair of earrings from them and another two necklaces from my last collaboration and I just love wearing um everything to be honest uh, but yeah these ones are super cute I wear them like every single day so my like 
I don't feel comfortable with having two large earrings, especially because one of my holes on, um, I can't remember which side, but it's a little bit bigger than the other side. So if I wear like something heavy, it just doesn't look right. It kind of looks uneven. Um, but yeah, these ones I absolutely love. I don't take them off pretty much um, because they're just so tiny and they, I think they look really pretty and I love the color of them, the stone. It's like a, like a turquoisey blue. Um, so yeah, I'm actually wearing another pair of earrings from them, but my favorite thing is this bracelet. Like how gorgeous is this guys? So I would 100% recommend um, gifting someone you love something from Ana Luisa. And I have a 20% code to share with you guys, which is going to be in my description box below. So if you are looking into getting anything, please do click on the link and um, just purchase throughout that. It doesn't cost you anything else, anything extra from what you would pay, but it's going to hopefully help me to have a chance to work with them again. Um, also wanted to mention another thing that they have 20% um, off site-wide currently. It's their end of year sale. And I believe it started on the 20th of December and it's going to last until the 10th of January. Now, if you use my code, you can't have 20% on top of the 20% that they're doing at the moment. So you only be able to use one or the other. If you are looking to get something, I would really appreciate you using my code. Um, and basically my code is going to be valid that you can use, you know, when they when they're not doing any kind of promotions or sales, you can always use it in between that. So um, yeah, I just wanted to kick off with the most gorgeous jewellery brand and show you these pieces. Um, if you do end up purchasing anything, please let, let, let me know um, how you found the products, whether you think they're, you know, good, whether if you gifted it to someone, um, they were happy, just leave your impressions um, for me down below. And yeah, that was the first thing that I wanted to discuss. The other gifts that I'm going to talk about are things which I think are quite nice as well. Um, so <laughs> this can be a little bit of a tricky item, but I would say gifting someone perfume is really, really nice. Now, if you know the person well and you know that they like, for example, like sweet scents or fresh scents or floral, then it's a little bit easier. If it's someone that you're not sure of, then it can go kind of either way. But um, I just wanted to show you one fragrance that I really actually like, and I'm I was really surprised with the fact that I did like it. I don't know, I just thought that I wouldn't. Because um, normally like these celebrity fragrances and stuff, I'm not really too keen on. But I do really like this Britney Spears Fantasy fragrance for like every day. And it smells really nice and sweet. I like sweet scents. I don't like like sickly sweet. Mmm, that smells so beautiful. I don't like sickly sweet. Like my favourite fragrances have normally like vanilla scent and yeah vanilla or musk but they're not like too overpowering or like sickly because i don't like when it smells like sweets <laughs> um, but yeah i really like this one and you know only need a tiny amount so this one i actually got on a sale um i don't know whether they're doing it at the moment but i'm sure they will be if they're not already this is the 50 ml so it's a tiny bottle but it lasts a really long time you only need a couple of sprays uh I think it was on sale for around £16, so I would definitely recommend fragrances. I think they make a beautiful, beautiful gift. Another thing that I would recommend is diaries. So <laughs> I personally love receiving like diaries, journals, this kind of thing, but like really cute, pinky ones. I'm, I'm quite girly when it comes to this. Um, so one of my favourite, like this is the one that I've actually got for myself for 2023. I wanted something quite simple, um, something that's not too expensive. I think this one was like £10 or something. I got it from Etsy. And the thing I like about it is like it's a non-dated planner. Um, so I'll just show you how it looks. So you've got the days of the week here. So you've got Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, and then weekend you've got like... Um, it's together you can use uh, this little section for both Saturday and Sunday and um, you here you can write which week you're on your weekly focus weekly go goals which I really like your to-do list and then your goal tracker I thought this was really cool this is probably one of the main reasons that I got it so I've had like really nice diaries in the past but um, some of them were like really big and not practical to carry around 
so I just ended up not actually using them after like a month or so of use uh, but yeah this one I really like it's just simple cute pink um, and it's got this like glittery kind of effect I just think it's beautiful the diary that I had last year is quite similar um, and I think this is really really nice as well if you want to treat someone um, for a gift and you want to have it personalized I love the fact that you can you know put your initials on there so I've got mine with my initials um, you can choose the color they've got so many different ones and I just think it's a pretty cute um, diary I did like this one and I have used it a lot and this is kind of what it looks like so you've got your top three tasks for the week your days of the week uh, your notes section and other to do's and then at the bottom which I thought was a really nice touch every week you have a new um, quote so I love that also something that I'm on a hunt for is a nice journal because I'm starting to journal um, from the new year again uh, this year I didn't really get any journaling done which is something that I really miss actually um, so I'm looking to get back into that so I would recommend like getting someone a beautiful like you know um, journal diary that they could that's you know no dates on it or anything like that, that they could just use to um, journal their thoughts in or they can use it as a work notebook or whatever I just think it's a nice gift to give to someone and they've got some beautiful ones out there um, one that I really really liked was Alex and Ash I think I had that about two years ago and it's the pause journal this was incredible so it had like little stories in between um, it had like questions I think for you then it had blank pages where you could write things that you wanted and I've still got this and I'm going to keep it forever because I like to look back through like memories and things that I've written in there um, but yeah I'll definitely recommend them as I said anything that I do mention I'm going to pop in the description box below so in case you are interested in getting it for yourself or for someone else you can you know have a look through there and see if there's anything that pleases you and by the way none of this is sponsored I'm not getting paid for anything no commissionable links nothing like that so everything that I'm showing you is things that I genuinely love and you know have or would buy for someone or would like to receive kind of thing um, <laughs> so yeah the next thing that I think is really nice to receive as well is books. Now, obviously, if you're not into reading, that's something that, you know, you can just skip past. But I absolutely love reading and I think it's such, such, such a nice gift to give to someone. And there's so many different kinds of books that you can give. You know, if someone's into like cooking or baking, you can give like a recipe book. Um, you know, if someone is a new mum, you can give like a book relating to, you know, bringing up children or whatever is, whatever interests, you know, the person has. It's just such a nice, thoughtful gift, I think. And, you know, with a book, it's something that will last for years as well and something that will actually give you some knowledge um, that will add something to your life. So I definitely love receiving books and I love gifting books. <laughs> um, Another thing that I would say is beautiful to receive as a gift is candles, especially at like this kind of wintry time, um, Christmas, New Year, because it's just so cold outside and just having, there's just something about having a candle lit um, that just makes the space look like really nice and romantic and cozy and I just, I just love burning candles throughout the winter in general, but like in the winter time, like specifically. And... I, I've started to lean more into like the soy candles or beeswax candles because I just they're just better for you like for you they last longer they don't have so much of those fumes um, so I've kind of stopped buying like more of the generic ones and a brand that I really 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 love is Neon so I actually got gifted a Neon candle I think last year or the year before for Christmas from one of my friends and it's beautiful it was like a small one but it lasted for such a long time I think it was like 20 or 25 hours burning time and the smell was gorgeous so candles I would definitely have highly rated in the list um also like I think if you if you know makeup can be a little bit tricky but if you know kind of like I mean foundations and stuff like that I would never buy because it's just you it's really hard to get the right colour match unless you know what they wear and what they love. That's 
different. But makeup, I, like things like blushes, bronzers, eyeshadow palettes, this kind of things, I think are really nice to gift. Um, and a brand that I have recently been loving is Refi Beauty. I've got so many things from them. So I originally started with buying the eyebrow kit, which was the first thing that I think they started selling once they, um, once they launched. And the kit has like an eyebrow pencil, the um, gel to help stick your eyebrows down, and also the brow pomade. So I did like all of the things, but I'm not too keen on the eyebrow gel because for me, for some reason, it just like tends to like, I don't know, start to like kind of flake off, which just, I don't, just don't like the way that it looks. I like it when I first initially put it on, but then I'm not too keen on it. Um, and the eyebrow pencil was quite nice. I finished it, mm, but I didn't really think it's like, wow. The thing that I've really been enjoying is the brow pomade this one and I think it's really nice because it just gives like a natural um, effect so you can just fill it in and um, then I like just using like a clear brow gel when I have one to just brush my um, eyebrows down because they kind of tend to stick out but yeah this is really nice their bronzer is absolutely beautiful this is like the newest thing that I've purchased from them I absolutely love it I'm going to show you the color this is the sand color So, so, so pretty. Um, their brush is amazing. So I would definitely recommend getting this if you're gonna purchase a bronzer or blusher for, for someone. And their little blushes are really nice as well. I've got one in the color Malaya and it's such a pretty um, pinky color, if you can see. So I would recommend that. And also another new item that I tried from them is their new lip sculpts. So this is in the colour Rosewood, so I've just outlined my lips um, and I just think it looks really really pretty, really natural. For me personally, like I find it really difficult for any lipsticks to last on my lips, which is why I don't tend to wear them. I hate like when I eat or do something or talk or have it on for a long time and it starts to come off. Especially like if it's a darker colour, if it's like a red or something, it just looks horrible when it like wears off. These are supposed to be like really long lasting because once you apply the line lip liner around then you also have this section in the bottom which is like this kind of clear liquidy jelly type thing that you put around which is supposed to stop the um, product from smudging and from coming off. Um, I do think it lasts a little bit longer than the other products that I've tried. Uh, from other brands however it still does come off for me especially when i eat so if you know of any lip liners or lip um lipsticks that don't just don't budge let me know because i'm really looking to purchase um a couple of those um oh also one more thing that i love from the refi brand is the gloss highlighter sorry i need to clean this it's been in my makeup bag so something spilt on it um, this is really pretty. I'm going to show you a swatch. I don't have any on at the moment, but I don't, I'm not a fan of like powdery things and I like uh, makeup to look quite dewy. So I love the fact that this is like a liquid, liquid highlighter. Can you see? I've just left it on quite thick. I don't know, the camera is not really focusing properly. But basically it's really, really natural looking. When you apply it on like your nose, um, on your cheeks, on any areas, it just gives you a beautiful glow. Um, especially when there's like lighting and you're turning and kind of thing. But it doesn't look like really, it doesn't look powdery or fake or like too shimmery. Um, so yeah, I would definitely recommend this brand for makeup. For eyeshadows, I personally really like Mm, Charlotte Tilbury ones. Um, I had a really nice palette from them a long time ago, which I actually want to get for myself again. I love their makeup in general. Um, also had the Urban Decay Original Naked palette, which I thought was really nice, and I used that for quite a while. And hmm, what else? Those would probably be my top two for eyeshadows. Um, another couple of items which I'm going to recommend. Um, is this beautiful watch 
this is one of my favourite things that I have and I wear it all the time. I just think it's so pretty for day to day. It's the Casio one. And unbelievably, it's only like, I, I believe, I don't remember the exact price, but I got it from Argos and I think it was around 35, maybe even less. Um, I just think it's so beautiful, really simple for every day. Um, and yeah, I just love the colour of it as well. Obviously, if you've got a bigger budget, you can buy a different watch. But I just think like, I'm, I'm not really into like all this expensive stuff. Um, designer brands and stuff. I mean, like, if I had all this money, I probably would have a couple of designer items, but I'm not, like, a big fan of, like, oh, I have to have a Dior bag or a Chanel bag. I'm just happy with, like, a normal bag. Um, but I like good quality things. So, like, you know, leather, something that can last for a really long time. Um, <laughs> yeah, things like that, basically. Uh, another thing which I think is a really nice thing to gift to someone is something like this. And this I purchased for myself a little while ago. It's the K Facial, um, I don't know how to call it, like one of those sculpting machines. And it's got battery inside. Oh, one second. Maybe the, oh, one. Yeah, can you hear it vibrating? Oh, I think it might, the battery might need to be changed. But it's just something nice that you can pamper yourself with. Yeah. Come on, what's wrong? Anyway, I think the battery needs to be changed. However, it's, oh no, here we go. This feels so nice. So I like to sometimes do this for myself um, in the evenings. Once I've cleaned my skin, just pop a little bit of face oil on and just, you know, give myself like a little mini massage. And Kimo loves it as well. So sometimes he asks me to do it for him. Um, but I had a couple of other things from this brand, which I wasn't really keen on. So I had a little machine that was like for doing a hydrofacial at home and it was absolute rubbish um it didn't work i contacted the brand they sent me a new one exact same issue and then i never bothered to contact them because it, time had just gone past so i kind of lost money on that one and another thing that i have is their um facial steamer which i think i mean i don't know i just don't think it's great it's okay but um not as good as this like this i would definitely recommend it's lovely um mm, 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 mm. another thing which i think is lovely to gift someone for christmas or for a birthday or for whatever kind of occasion is a treatment so like if you're able to like give them a facial um a massage of some kind um a voucher for like for them to get their nails or something done i just think this is so beautiful because a lot of the time we don't prioritize ourselves well i know that i don't especially if you're a mum and you have you know little ones around it's just really hard to find some time to pamper yourself and to like slow down and relax so i think it's a perfect perfect gift um, to give anyone and I mean who doesn't like having their nails done or their pedicure or you know um, their hair or some kind of treatment on their body um, also clothing vouchers I personally love receiving clothes and I love giving clothes um, it can be a little bit hard like when you're buying for someone else because you don't want to get something that's it like you know if it's the wrong size it's just with the hassle of like returning and changing or whatever or also like the fact that they might might not like um the item that you picked so i think a clothing voucher is a really nice gift um you know in one of their favorite shops if you know that they like shopping in h&m for example um getting them a h&m voucher or tk maxx or whichever store it is it doesn't really matter but i just think that's something really really nice to do uh also experiences experiences are wonderful gifts so you know um just booking in some kind of like activity or something that they've never done before that they can do with someone else or even with you um i think is a really special gift because something again that will last for a lifetime that they can you know create beautiful memories with and just you know something that they that will make your bond closer like i always feel things when you buy things obviously it's nice to receive like items but then when you have an experience and you make new memories together it's a lot more meaningful and it will last throughout your whole life it's something that you're always going to look back on um you know that something that you can smile about that you can 
talk about your children, grandchildren in years to come, share with like other people. It's just something that will add to your life in general. And then there's another two items that I wanted to talk about. And one is something that I actually received this morning and it's natural deodorant. Now you might think this is like a little bit weird. Why would you give someone deodorant? But I just think it's like such a nice gift to give because especially if you know that someone is into like more natural things, um, eco-friendly things, I'm really trying to be more thoughtful in terms of what I put on my body. Um, so I, I just want to avoid using aluminium and alcohol um, in my deodorant. So I've tried a couple of different brands and I've been really, really persistent with one, which is I think Mitchum one. I loved the scent of it so much, it was like the coconut one, that I just bought it like three times and I kept trying to, you know, trying to like hope that it's gonna work but it just didn't work for me like once I would have a shower and pop it on it would be fine for a couple of hours but then after that I just ugh, I just didn't feel it was doing its job properly so I just did a little bit of research and decided to get this one so I haven't tried it yet but hopefully I've got high hopes for it I hope it's gonna be good um it's kind of like a lemon citrusy scent which I really like as well um, and yeah, the packaging is 100% recyclable, and yeah, I just thought we'll try this one out. I haven't used it yet, so yeah, I'm going to try that out later on today after I have a shower. And another thing which I think is pretty good to gift is like hair tools. Um, so it's something that I would like to receive and that I like giving as well. Um, and one that I wanted to show you, which I think is pretty good, is this volumizing... Um, Revlon brush really really nice because it dries your hair and it just adds that extra volume um, I've wanted to get that Dyson Airwrap thing for a while but I just cannot justify spending that much money on something like that and I just don't I think it's like more hyped up than than actually how good, how good it is I don't know I just think like you can get more affordable tools that are going to kind of give you the same results um, another like thing that I'm looking into getting is like a crimpler, you know, the hair crimpler, I think that's what it's called, like the waves, I just love that look and a good curler. Um, I love the idea of the Dyson for like, you know, when you want to have the curls because you just wrap it around and it just looks beautiful when you see the adverts and people doing their hair with it. But I think there's much more affordable options out there which I'm going to look into. But yeah, I think like a nice hair tool is quite a nice gift to give to someone. Um, so I hope you guys enjoyed this little gift guide for her. Let me know if you'd like me to do like more of these kind of videos. So like a gift guide for him, um, for kids, uh, maybe for like new mums. Um, like there's so many different occasions and um, things that I can think of that I could do. So if you'd like to see another one, you have an idea of something that you'd like, let me know. And I will try to get that filmed. Um, I really, really hope you enjoyed this video. If you get any of the items, do let me know. And honestly, guys, don't forget to check out Anna Luisa. Check out their sale. Use the link in my description box. And you will not regret it. I promise you. Like, look at this. <laughs> I'm going to show you this beautiful bracelet one more time. When I showed this to my husband, Kimo, he was like obsessed and I showed it to my sis one of my sisters as well. She was like, oh my God, it's so beautiful. Like just everything about it. I know that this is going to be a piece that I'm going to just not be taking off my hand. Um, it's something that just, I feel like goes with like dressy outfits, with everyday outfits. You can literally wear it all the time and it just looks so pretty on. Um, and yeah, I just love the little packaging. I love that they are carbon neutral. I love that they're affordable. And I just love everything about them. I love the fact that I've been given this opportunity to work with them again. So thank you so much, Anna Luisa. And thank you guys for watching this video. Please um, don't forget to like, subscribe, leave any comments down below. And I will see you in my next vlog.